Hey guys, good evening. Well, today is cannot be the twentieth again. <laughs> yeah, today's not the twentieth. Today's the twenty-first. All right, I got black pepper, chili powder, ginger garlic paste, bigger chicken, yesterday's chicken, the yogurt, the salt. Let's make it the proper way this time. Okay, guys, I'm going to show you this time step by step. All right, I'm going to be putting in about that much. That was quarter. Say about a little less than half a tablespoon of the haldi powder, turmeric powder. Okay, then let's get down to the chili powder. I'm going to be putting. I like my stuff a little spicy, so a little bit more chili powder than yesterday because now I'm making two pieces of legs, okay? So I'm going to be putting one full tablespoon, that's half, that's another half tablespoon. Okay, now I got very less ginger garlic paste, anyways ginger garlic paste doesn't go on this, it goes onto the chicken, so that's alright marinate a little less I got my pepper powder here and I'm gonna take about a little over a teaspoon full of pepper powder Just let me pack that put it back in so that's that. I'm gonna put a little salt. Yeah, I'm gonna be putting about that much salt, a little over a pinch. Say two pinches of salt. And now what I'll do is I'll just mix it in. Okay, so I'll mix that and I'll continue recording. Okay, so I've mixed it properly with a fork. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to keep this in the fridge and let it stand for some time while I cut the chicken, you know, slit the chicken so I can marinate that with ginger, garlic paste, salt and a lemon. Alright guys, today's cider is going to include potato mash as well with capsicum and uh, fried potatoes, uh, fried tomatoes, alright. Alright guys, so I got the potatoes mashed and I put in some pepper. So what I've done is I put the mashed potatoes inside a capsicum, hari mirch, yeah. I put all inside here and later is when I'm going to cook the chicken. After cooking the chicken, I'm going to fry this on that and after that I'm going to fry the tomatoes on that as well. Alright, you'll see that later on in the night. So I've just finished cooking one side, now I'm going to be cooking the other side. I'm not going to show you this because I did this yesterday, yeah. Got the sugar in, now time for the water. Added the water. Now all I got to do is shake that, and I'll show you what it looks like. So that's that. Plus is done. Now I'll give you some information about these two bottles. I'd gone on Swiggy, and I'd ordered chocolate milkshake. Those motherfuckers, yeah, they charged me 130 bucks for each of these bottles, man. 260 for chocolate milk. The same shit I made yesterday for about wait. 23 and 29 40 52 or 53 bucks where I got four of these bottles yeah one liter of chocolate milk lassi that's with yogurt yeah if I just buy chocolate milk and make it it would have cost me about 49 yeah and they charged me 260 yeah then you gotta put in add in the what you call that the delivery charge of 50 bucks so they charged me about 280 bucks for these two bottles. Fucking cunts. Okay guys, this is what it looks like. I've done both the sides. Now, as you might have noticed, I put some water in because I put a lot of, uh, what you call it, uh, masala. Yeah, so now I'm just going to dry down the water at 130 and I'm going to leave the top open. As you can see, it's already done. It's juicy and unlike yesterday, it's nice and red instead of that yellow because of the chili powder and I just tasted it. Wow, it is super spicy. Good thing I got that lassi in, yeah? 